Almost six years ago, I met Chandler Berghofer. Little did I know I would be meeting an amazing, lifelong friend and one of the kindest hearts I've ever known. She has always opened her arms to me whenever I needed it. There's constant laughter and joy when she is around, which reminds me of all the fun and silly things we have done together. We have cried together, laughed together, supported each other through life's ups and downs. It's her kind and caring and loving heart that convinces me Zach is getting the best companion for life. She's all yours. <laughs> Every good and perfect gift comes from above. And Chandler, you truly are a perfect gift from God. And I vow to love you and treasure you as such for the rest of my life. I vow to never stop going on fun and often spontaneous adventures with you. I vow to be there for you when loving you is easy and when loving you is difficult. To love you when you struggle to love yourself. To point you every day to Christ and to help you grow more and more into the godly woman you are and are becoming. To build a marriage that will glorify God and point others to Him. To start a family with you that is filled with laughter, love, faith, and hope in Jesus. And I vow to keep growing as a man and as a husband so I can love you better every day for the rest of our lives. <laughs> So Lord, we just come before you right now and I thank you for Zach, I thank you for Chandler. And now Lord, we look forward to seeing what you're going to do in their lives as a married couple for your glory. Lord, we pray that you might bless them, that you might use them. Thank you for this celebration. Let us eat, drink, and be merry, Lord, tonight as we honor and worship you. for Mr. and Mrs. Galaxy. I had this really difficult moment in my life where I was processing through a lot. Looking back, I see so much more how he exemplifies this verse of helping other people carry their burdens. I like just needed a friend to be there and to listen to me. He is the kind of guy who is so good at just humbly helping carry other people's burdens. Zachary, ever since I was a little girl, I dreamed of finding my Prince Charming. But as soon as I finally surrendered my deep desire for marriage, God brought you into my life. Zachary, you are my sweetest gift. In you, I have found the one whom my soul loves. You are more perfect for me than I could have ever imagined. And I'm so thankful God brought me to you. Thank you for loving me, cherishing me, choosing me, and reminding me that I am someone to be treasured, not in spite of all of my quirks and insecurities, but because of them. Thank you for making me feel like I'm the most special and beautiful girl in the world. You are my best friend. You're my confidant. You're my teammate, my favorite adventure buddy, and my biggest cheerleader. And I'm so excited to start this grand adventure called Marriage Together. I do. I do. May he be gracious to you, show you his favor, and give you his peace. I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. She has been so godly in her waiting. She did not waver. She did not drift. She remained steadfast because she was rooted in her relationship with the Lord. Now, I know that everybody is thinking one thing. How could this beautiful, thoughtful, kind, godly woman possibly be Bill Burkhopper's daughter. We all know that Taylor gets her best qualities from the real superhero of the family, Shannon. <laughs> all kidding aside, I love you, Bill. Chandler, I love you so much. To Zach and Chandler, may your life
life together shine forth the glories of the gospel. Oh,